Hi, welcome to the summer TNA. We had a small technical glitch, so we're re-recording for you. Thank you for your patience on this. Uh, it was so great to see so many of you in the Zoom, and we definitely miss seeing you in person. Uh, with all our meetings, we like to start with a statement of acknowledgments. So, we acknowledge the land on which we reside in Portland metro area rests on traditional village sites of the Multnomah, Wasco, Cowlitz, Kathlamet, Clackamas, Bands of Chinook, Tualatin, Kalapuya, Malala, and many other tribes who made their homes along the Columbia River, creating communities and summer encampments to harvest and use the plentiful natural resources of the area. And we take this opportunity to thank the original caretakers of this land. We recognize the following statements are true and important to repeat, repeat frequently. Black lives matter. Trans rights are human rights. Science is real. Disabilities are respected. People and planet are valued over profit. And people are in charge of their own bodies. Uh, so thank you again for joining us. We have some fun that we want to go over with you for the fall, some new colors and uh, plans going forward into the future. And we just have a few housekeeping things we want to take care of real fast. We're still in a pandemic. And so our schedule reflects that, our lifestyle reflects that. Uh, thankfully, the school year has wrapped up, but our children are still at home. So uh, email responses might still be a little bit delayed and that is a-okay. We definitely try to get back to you as soon as we can, but thank you for your patience and compassion in our response time. Uh, you can email info at knittedwit.com that goes to me or hello at knittedwit.com that goes to Shannon and we talk a lot. So we definitely will see it in both of them. Uh, if you have any questions, again, please reach out. We also have um, reps that are ready to hit the road. Some you might have already seen, um, they're making appointments. We also have new rep kits that are out and we can't wait to see uh, what you get to do with them. They, I did not grab a set, <laughs> um, but the, the new colors are on rings and you can take them off and create your own color palettes. So uh, we hope you enjoy those. <laughs> um, we also have some new reps in uh, Kim has retired from repping yarns, and so Illinois has a new one, and then uh, Minnesota, Iowa, Nebraska, maybe. Anyways, if you're in those areas, get in touch with me, and I will connect you with our new reps. Okie dokie. Uh, we will get... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> There's a full work crew here. It's so fun. <laughs> okay, so let's get to it. So our fall color palette is Dolly Parton inspired themed. We love Dolly and we went down a deep rabbit hole with, uh, what's the podcast called? Um, Dolly's America, I think. Fantastic pod podcast. Uh, so we were inspired by her and we wanted to make some magic and uh, we released a couple colors earlier this year in a kit and Maria from A Needle Runs Through It made these awesome stitch marker sets uh, with our theme. Please contact her if you're interested in stocking those. All right, let's jump into it. So I'm gonna do the variegated first and then go to the solids. And quick reminder, we sell in quantities of four and you can order this on any yarn base. Uh, we'll have a one pager information sheet about it that you can peruse through to just refresh because I'm gonna go through everything pretty quickly. Hard Candy Christmas. And it's really hard to not just start singing all the songs as I read these to you. <laughs> Coat of Many Colors. And these are all on our fingering yarn base. And Rhinestone World. Love is Like a Butterfly. And uh, Sandy, the main dyer here, she puts the yarn in the pan and then puts black lines so it looks like a butterfly's wings and fills in those gaps with color. It's pretty awesome. I'll share a picture next time she's dying that one. Uh, tra traffic starts jumping. Clear blue morning. I love this color. Great Smoky Mountain National Park because we had to. It's all wrong, but it's all right. And this is just mm, so gorgeous. Okay. Wildflower. So this was inspired by the Tennessee's uh, state wildflower. 
and I can't remember the name. We'll include it in an email, I'm sure. <laughs> but it's very beautiful pink. Uh, Sexy Love and Lies. Flaming Locks of Auburn Hair. <laughs> Ooh, these two together. This is, this is my happy place. Bittersweet Memories. Oh my gosh, in the podcast, they talked about Whitney Houston covering the song for the movie Bodyguard. And um, just listen to podcasts. I'm not going to retell you the story, but it's really good. Blondes have more fun. Eyes of emerald green. Islands in the stream. And cup of ambition. While we think they all go great together, if you're not interested in the whole collection, you can pick and choose. Uh, but the theme is Dolly, and there's 16 colors total. I did. <clears throat> okay, so um, real quick, we also have, it's in the catalog, which I think we've sent out in an email. Um, we'll probably include it again. So we have lots of fun swag items. We have washi tape. And we have pins. These are also available for you. This was from our Advent box last year, and we will definitely have um, swag to match our Advent box this year. Not an Advent, but you know, that time of year Advent. So those are available to you as well. Uh, big exciting news, minis are back. We were able to uh, get some from a new supplier, and their supply chain has started started to even out and as long as they're in stock we can dye them but of course if supply chain gets bumped that will affect us so we have 20 gram skeins and these this yarn base is new to us it is not available in full skeins currently and most likely won't because i still really love sock and i want to keep that in its where it is and how we use it so the gems 20 grams they are 92 yards and it's 75 percent superwash merino and 25 percent nylon and it's a pretty slim yarn compared to our sock and then i just grabbed a set this is a uh, happy birthday these are 10 grams and if you ordered a 10 gram set of happy birthday this is how it would come and that's also something new with the minis is how you can order them we have them available in pallets both for your ease and our ease of ordering you can do a 40 color and it will be all the colors that are included in our three solid palettes, Rainbow Magic, Happy Birthday, and Little Black Dress. You can also get variegated palettes and again, available in 10 or 20 grams. So that's awesome. Okay, so 2022, we're definitely still doing herstory and we are also going to have a, an iteration of Shanna Jean. We're combining Shanna Jean and uh, the birds and bees because we feel like we have maxed out how many bees we can dye. Um, we're, we're combining them and coming up with a new creation. So we'll be sharing that with you uh, later this year. Uh, we're doing the temperature project again. That is something Shannon and I have both really enjoyed doing and seeing the way different people have made them. I'm doing a high and a low. So this is January and all the way up into our massive heat wave. And then Shannon is doing the averages and so you can see the blocks of colors. There's our winter storm and then coming up into our massive heat wave. So that's been a really great community project. Um, we'll have a couple different color palettes available. We also include with Shannon's pattern, because uh, we're using the persistence wrap pattern, we created handy dandy charts so that you can track temperatures and if you've uh, you done the knitting or crocheting, whatever crack you're using for the day. And then this also a gauge and to hold your yarn in place so that you can remember what color goes where. Uh, I think I totally jumped over our advent. So let's go back. 
So uh, we're still taking orders for that. We're gonna cut it off pretty soon. We do have a maximum of how many we can offer. This lovely pattern that is sneaking into the screen. This is what we're going to be making this year. So the yarn is going to be different. Last year we had 20 minis. This year we're going to do a full skein plus eight minis. And we're doing the cycle of the moon. We're still going to be having a card every day plus a little nifty gifty or a skein. We have uh, partnered with Maria from A Needle Runs Through It and Squire Country, Country Crafts for the buttons because there's buttons to attach. And uh, some of the same goodies as last year, but we mixed it up a bit. We're super excited about this project. and. I know that the project was very meaningful us, meaningful for me and Shannon last year, but also the community. Um, the feedback we got and just how meaningful every card was for all the different days was really incredible. So we definitely encourage you to bring this into your community and um, have conversations around it. And the cards are usable outside of that month. Like again, our cards last year, you can just draw a day and do something meaningful with it. Um, I think that's it. I'm trying to think if there was any questions that were asked in the Zoom that we answered. Um, and I don't recall any. I don't think so, yeah. I'm not asking Shannon off screen. <laughs> um, I think most of the questions, most of the conversation was about Dolly and the podcast. Yeah, Dolly and the podcast. And we'll include that in the, in the notes of the email so that we send you to the right place. Um, Thank you again. We are so glad that you are here and that we are here. And yeah, we look forward to hearing you from you. Have a great day. <laughs>